Since gaining independence in 1966, Botswana has been building up its income foundation majorly on the basis of diamond mining. Taxation in Botswana is source-based. This means that the residence of the taxpayer is considered for the calculation of taxable income. The income generated from the source or deemed to be from the source in Botswana is taxable. Generally, any income generated outside of Botswana is not taxable. However, there are some exceptions. Keep watching. Botswana Unified Revenue Services. Botswana Unified Revenue Services, BURS, is a government-sponsored entity and is in charge of revenue services in Botswana. BURS is responsible for tax collection, providing tax assistance to taxpayers, filtering erroneous and fraudulent tax filings. BURS functions and carries its activities through the Ministry of Finance and Development as specified by the BURS Act. All the taxes and revenues applicable in the country are collected by BURS. Resident Tax Compliance Personal income tax earned by resident employees is generally recovered by withholding tax under pay as you earn pay at the source. This way, the taxes are deducted directly from the salary by the employer and paid directly to the government. Withholding tax is to be paid within 15 days of the end of the month of the deduction. Residents with gross incomes exceeding the earnings threshold are required to register as taxpayers and file their tax returns no later than the 30th of September. The earnings threshold is renewed annually. The latest rates can be found on our website. Extensions are given on requests. Non-resident tax compliance. Non-residents who derive income from the source in Botswana are required to register as taxpayers in Botswana. They are liable for filing tax returns in the same way as residents. Non-residents are taxed differently from residents as there are no minimum earning exemptions. This, however, is charged on the minimum tax bracket of 5%. Types of taxable income. Any amount that is received in any type of compensation and remuneration earned in Botswana or deemed to be earned in Botswana is considered as taxable income. This includes any income received by the person, basic salary, leave pay, bonuses, etc. This may also include fees, commissions, credits to accounts, cash allowances, and non-cash benefits. Tax exemptions. Expatriates in Botswana are only exempted on one-third of contractual annual gratuity. What's exempted within employment contracts? For starters, one-third of gratuity is paid. This can be paid after completion of a minimum of two years in service. Health insurance, any medical costs paid by employers, is also exempt. Finally, a third of the retrenchment benefits received from employers are tax exempt. In addition, there are some instances where individuals are tax exempt in Botswana. This generally happens in the case of employees of diplomatic missions or employees of companies that provide technical assistance to the government of Botswana. Payroll taxes. As per Botswanan Unified Revenue Services, BURS, every employer with non-residence employees and resident employees earning income more than the taxable threshold must withhold tax. This should be done on the standard tax rate and the amount should be remitted on a monthly basis to BURS. This is done before the 15th day of the next month. An annual return has to be filed within 31 days of the financial year end. If you're looking for more information about the taxation in Botswana, then be sure to visit our accompanying page. There, you can also use your Botswana tax calculator to easily calculate taxes and more. Thanks for watching. Let us know what you thought of all this with a comment. Then, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a like. And consider subscribing to our channel to stay up to date with our great tax guides and tools.